New at 10 tonight, dramatic body cam video. Police in Duluth took down two robbery suspects who didn't make it very far. Good evening, I'm Russ Spencer. I'm Courtney Bryan. Authorities say the men broke into a gas station on Buford Highway. Fox 5's Alexa Liaco joins us now. And Alexa, in addition to the body cam and dash cam video, there is surveillance of the takedown, but authorities also used another tool to help make this arrest. They did. They used their drone with heat sensing technology to catch the crooks that broke into the shell station here, but they really didn't make it far. Officers found them just a few moments later inside that dumpster. Yeah, I saw them literally jump out of the front door of the business. We got units set up. I got one down here. If not a train to leave, I will find you. It will bite you. Duluth police drove by a burglary on Buford Highway at the Shell station as it was happening. He pulled into the Shell gas station and then witnessed that uh, the glass was shattered. The officer called for backup on the ground Try to make a big circle and, close okay. in, right? and in the air with a drone. That can, you know, pretty much look at a larger scale area with uh, the capabilities of uh, night vision and heat, heat uh, image. Right on this area. Right Local business owner Jose Sanchez happened to be working late Friday night. I was actually working in one of the uh, Duluth police officer vehicle that I need to get it ready for the next day. And when he saw the officers, he checked his security cameras and couldn't believe his eyes. I'm like, you know, let me just look on the on my videos. And sure enough, you know, it was just like, they're up there. He helped lead officers up some stairs to these dumpsters. Come on, now, you're here. You're here. Officers arrested these two men, Terry Price and Leonanche Carson. It was just funny they were inside the, the dumpster, you know, so, but uh, it was good. It's good that they got him. Police say they're glad they had the tools and technology to find the burglars quickly. We try to do everything that we can to bring some sort of justice to the, the victims here. Including help from members of the community. I got family here, so it made me feel good. You know, it made us go to sleep and sleep well when they got him. Now, those two men are facing charges for burglary and obstruction. But stay with us because coming up on Fox 5 News Edge at 11, one of those men did something else after he was arrested that might create more charges for him in the future. We'll tell you about that coming up in the next hour. Live in Duluth, Alexa Liaco, Fox 5 News.